high. To me, the most influential part in the sound chain is the speakers, uh, or at least for vintage rock, it's the speakers. Uh, and, and the most influential, by far most influential vintage rock speaker is the Celestian Greenback. You know, those uh, uh, existed from the mid 60s and until 1980, and then they, they were reissued in the early 90s. Uh, but it was until 1973 that they had pulsonic cones, then, then allegedly the factory that, that uh, built those uh, paper cones burnt down. Unfortunately, with the formula uh, of the cones in, in the factory. So since then, uh, there hasn't been speakers. Basically, since '73, there have, haven't been speakers that has that that beautiful, uh, beautiful top end uh, and, and growl that those speakers have. Uh, so when I tried the fullback, the fullback is a 15 inch, you know, 12 inch speakers is the most famous. The fullback is, is a 15 inch uh, uh, greenback like speaker. Uh, I was completely blown away. Uh, I compared it to a Celestian uh, G12M50 Greenback with Plutonic Cones from 1972. And that's what we're going to listen to in this clip. Uh, to me, the fullback, a 115, an open back 115 with a fullback in it, sounds like a complete 1960 cab from, from the early 70s with the G12M. Uh, 25, 75 hertz pulsonic greenbacks in it. Uh, I, I'm, I'm going to need more videos to uh, to uh, confirm this, but 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 my my initial impression here is is that it's a world class speaker that uh, I and, and many with me have waited for long. Uh, so it's a bit embarrassing that I'm it's first now that I'm I'm uh, reviewing it, but better late than never. Now first I'm going to play these two speakers in the mix with backing track with bass and drums. And then afterwards we're going to have the same same riffs but without the backing track. So you get a good uh, good view of uh, how they performed showcased and, and in the mix. All right, let's go. <laughs> 